Hello everyone and welcome back. Um, we're gonna do the PD cars um, in this one. So we'll go through all the PD vehicles, including um, a couple of other vehicles that um, Los Santos Police Department has in their fleet. So as you can see in front of me, we've got the five vehicles, which is including the bike. Or is that six? It's definitely five, good. Just thought I was seeing things. Anyway, so we'll move on to directly to my left, which will be the helicopter. So right here we have a helicopter. I can't remember exactly what make and model this helicopter is. I can't remember. So yeah, kind of gonna have to bear with me on that one because I can't remember. But anyway, this is our police chopper. Obviously it has Tampa livery on it. That's what I was trying to get out of my mouth. Um, so let's start her up. You know, it has full working dials and all that kind of thing. Um, all that stuff works. Fire extinguisher, beautiful. And yeah, very nice helicopter. So that's Air One. Anyway, so we will move on to. My camera's really zoomed down, I don't like it. Um, We'll move over, we'll go left to right, so we'll do the Crown Vic first, so... Um, the rest of these should be redneck models, apart from the bike. Yeah, so, anyway, so... Crown Vic, obviously, these all have the Vala light bar, except for the Fusion and the Taurus, they have the wheel, and so... A couple of different lighting options right there, I guess. Um, so... We'll go ahead and take a look in the Vic. Very nice car. Working dials and all that. Really nice model. I really like the Crown Vic. She's a beaut. Anyway, so that's the inside. And then we have the lighting of the Crown Vic. Um, Brandon did a really good job and changed up some of the lighting patterns of some of the Vala packs, so yeah. Obviously everything's an extra pretty much, just like the other cars, so. There's that. So that's the Vic. Then we have the Taurus. So that has the wheel on light bar. I love the takedowns on this thing. Um, so we have the interior. I kind of like the clutter. It's a little cluttered, but I kind of like it at the same time. It makes it look like it's used and, you know, cops use it sort of thing, so I like that. Um, and then we have the flash pattern, which may change soon. But I do like that pattern anyway, so... Yeah, so that's the pattern on the Taurus. Uh, next on we have the Fusion. Obviously another wheel on light bar the interior isn't as an amazing in this in this vehicle as you would hope but it's still a really nice car could be a bit better though but that's the inside and then it's got the same flash pattern as the Taurus they haven't been switched up just yet or anything like that so The fog lights do work. There we go. It's just the angle for some reason. So, it's a really nice model. Don't want the siren. We'll have the takedowns though. So, that's the Fusion. Uh, next, we have the Explorer. So this has the Vala light bar, obviously. It's starting to get a little dark. And then we have the lighting. It's got some very nice lighting on it. We then have the interior. It's got a really neat, nice interior. I like it a lot. Single rear cage. Takedowns. 
you know, always a good thing. Um, obviously these models have the trunk and the hood that opens that slides out the, sh um, the drawer and all that, so I've shown that off in plenty of other videos, I'm not really gonna show it off again, it's exactly the same. Same with the Tahoe, when we get to that. The police bike. I love the bike, one of my favourite vehicles probably. We have the lighting. I believe this has some extras that can be toggled, which I have missed. Yeah, there's an extra couple of lights. So, it's quite a nice bike, I like it. And then we have the PD Tahoe, which has got a bit of dirt on it. She could do with a bit of a wash. Um, I will say the Tahoe is probably definitely one of my favourites, and it's got a dirt texture that looks amazing. So, you know, there's no dirt, there's full dirt. Like, looks looks amazing. Like that is an amazing dirt texture. I like it a lot. So that is the Tahoe. Um, we'll go ahead and take a look inside real quick. Same as the Sheriff one and the, and the um, Highway one. Lighting, Brandon did the lights on this, changed it up a little bit. So that looks really good. Actually, I will just do the hood and trunk real quick. Just, it's the same for the Explorer, but you know. So there's that. Really neat. And then, last but not least, we have our final vehicle, which is all the way down here. We have a beautiful sunset, like, look at that. Look at that sunset. Thing is beautiful. And here we have the police dinghy, so... Definitely another great vehicle. I love this boat a lot, actually, to be honest. Um, we'll go ahead and sit on it. Um, it's got all blues, so it's got minimal lighting. It's a police boat, you know, it does the job. So that's really neat. And then it has some extras, so... Nope, wrong button. So that can take off the bit around the side there. And then we've got extras here. These all control lighting, so... You can't really see it because it's not fully dark, but I mean, you can see the reflection of the pier there, so you know, lights up this place a lot. So, yeah, it's a really, really nice vehicle. But, um, that is gonna conclude the PD car tour, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it, and I will see you all in the next one.